Spherical Shape Capacitor Hi! In this video, we are going to discuss the spherical shape capacitor and see what's the problem behind using it. As we have discussed in earlier videos, the capacitance does not depend on the charge and voltage, but the dimension and medium of the capacitor. Let's say we have a sphere with a radius R. Now we also know that whatever charge we give to this sphere, it will reside only on the surface. Let's say we give it a charge Q. Now, according to the formula, capacitance is equal to charge by voltage. C is equal to Q by V. We know that V is equal to K into Q by R. Putting this value of V, we get C is equal to Q by K into Q by R. Q cancels each other and we get C is equal to R by K. Putting the value of K, we get C is equal to 4 pi epsilon into R. From the equation, we can see that the value of C depends on epsilon and R. Hence we can conclude that capacitance depends on the medium and dimensions only. If you look at the equations carefully, we can understand easily why we do not use spherical shape capacitors. When we put the value of R as 1 meter, we get the capacitance is equal to 1.1 into 10 to the power minus 10 farads. Meaning, a spherical shape capacitor has a capacity of this only. It takes more space, and the charge we can store in it is very less. Hence, we do not use spherical shape capacitors. This is it for today's video. Before leaving, check the exclusive offers, link in the description below. And do not forget to hit the like and subscribe button. To find out more on the subject, continue watching the next video.